Welcome to the practical section of the RDN show. It looks like we are about to have some party, but actually we're coming to demonstrate how a mother can prepare a complimentary feed at home uh, using a baby cereal. But first of all, I want to know something, Mr. Mensa. Yeah. Uh, how often can a mother um, initiate or feed the baby with a complimentary feed in a day? So between the ages of six months to eight months, okay. the mother can feed a complimentary uh, food two to three times in a day. In a day? Yes. Okay. Whilst breast uh, yeah. feeding continues. Okay. And then between nine to 11 months, 12 months, it can be between three to four times in a day. Okay. So that means the older the child gets, the more the frequency. Frequency you initiate yeah. the baby feed. Yeah. Thank you very much. So we have a baby cereal from mm. Jewel Foods. Yeah. Uh, actually, you can prepare this baby cereal at home, but if you want some, you can also contact Jewel Foods mm -hmm. for a baby cereal. And we have a warm water here, mm -hmm. so our pediatric dietitian will demonstrate how mm -hmm. to prepare a complimentary feed, especially with the consistency, how soft or pureed should the complimentary feed be. So, Mr. Mensa, uh, this is our baby cereal. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, so this is a baby cereal, okay. uh, which um, you could get off the shelf, yes. or if you want to prepare it yourself at home. home, depending okay. on the combination, uh, okay. you could do that. So. Now, we talked about the fact that the babies, um, after preparing the baby meal, okay. uh, whether it's in a porridge or whatever it is, mm -hmm. the texture and the consistency shouldn't be light. So now, we're yeah. going to do demonstrate how it's supposed to be, the okay. wrong one and then the right one. Okay, that's fine. So, um, so we have two um, cups. two con uh, cups here. Yeah, yeah. Containing warm water. Yeah. So literally, if you're boiling at home, mm -hmm. this is how it should go. We use the knife so that we can control the amount of um, powder or the uh, feed we about to prepare. So as you can see, um, we're stirring it. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's cool. Okay. Yes. So you can also prepare the same complimentary feed. If you have a baby cereal at home or if you need some, you can contact Joao Foods for this baby cereal. Okay, it's fine. Sorry? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so we are done with the first one. Mm. We are going to the second one. Sorry, let me help you out. All right. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. So, so this is warm water. Literally, if you are home and you are preparing a complimentary feed with a baby cereal. Okay, so that's it. Some more, close mm, just a little mm. bit more. Okay. Yeah, That's okay. 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 So, what we want to do, we want to demonstrate the, the texture and the fineness of a complementary feed. Literally, if you're using a, a baby mm. cereal like what we have here, okay, okay, so that's fine. So, okay. yeah, so we've prepared two um, cups of okay. baby cereal okay. in two different ways, yeah. And the texture is different, and that's what we want to demonstrate. And okay. like we said, we've said before, okay. that the thicker the texture, mm -hmm. um, the more nutrient dense okay. the food is. Okay. So we are sure that a spoon that goes into the mouth of the baby will contain more nutrients okay. than when it is lighter. Okay. So this cup, which I'll call uh, Exhibit A, mm -hmm. um, We've made it the right way. Okay. Now, the, the reason why it's the right way is that, and this is how you can find out, okay. is that when you scoop it with a spoon, okay. and you hold the spoon at 45 degrees, okay. it shouldn't pour, okay. or it shouldn't drip off. Okay. And so, at this thickness, you are sure that the child will get the right amount of nutrients that um, um, he or she needs okay. um, um, for growth. Okay. All right. So, so let's mm -hmm. transfer it here, yeah. like, so that we can see how it's, it yeah, so, so even if you're, it's, you realize it's difficult pouring, yeah, it comes like a paste. Form. That's, yeah. that's it. 
So this is the right way you can prepare yes. your complimentary food because yes. what happens the way it's very thick, a little he takes or the baby takes, um, it's uh, the baby gets its five very early as compared to this one. So this is not the way to go about it. Yes. This is the second one. So this is the second one. Okay. And I mentioned that the, the spoon should be held at 45 degrees. Okay. Now I'm trying to hold this spoon at 45 degrees. So, so you realize flowing. that almost everything that I picked up is off the spoon. Okay. This type of um, cereal mix is too light for a child. Okay. And and you you that means that what you feed the child, you end up getting a lot of volume of water mm -hmm. in the tummy of the child, okay. but very little or less nutrient dense or density of the meal that you want. Okay. And so when you feed a child, and let's say a child is able to take all this, mm -hmm. and another child B is also able to take all this, mm -hmm. the child who took this uh, cup okay. will get more nutrients than the child yeah, who sure. took and this cup, okay. even though they all feel satisfied at, uh, yes, at the same, same level time, of satiety, yeah. okay. but the nutrient density of one okay. will be more than the other. So this one will be the wrong way. Okay. You see how easily it's pouring. So like oh. milk. Yes. And and you find a, a, a number of mothers preparing porridges like this for their six, seven month old child because they think that the the cha the, the um, thickness of the porridge should just be or close to how breast milk is. Okay. All right, but that is actually wrong. So, so yeah. if you want to, uh, even with the poto potos, mm. you still have the same. Yeah, or it can even be a little thicker than, um, this. than this because okay. you can feed them with soft banku. Why? <laughs> yeah, so yeah, it can be, be a little bit thicker than okay. this. Yes. So this, these are two demonstrations we have that, here. That's it. The right way should go. It should be more thicker. Yes. Something like a honey. Yes. And well, if you do it even more, a bit thicker, thicker than the honey. But okay. the thing is that when you hold the spoon at forty-five degrees, it's, it's not pouring. Okay. Okay. Compared to to the ones the that one that when you hold at forty-five see, degree, yeah, yeah it's it's, like it's easily pouring. I'm not even able to hold it at forty-five That's degree. Fine. All right. So that is um, the demonstrations. Okay. So right consistency. The, the wrong, wrong one. one. Yeah. Yeah. The right one. Here. Yes. So so we've seen this one. Uh, but we have a question from our social media platform. Yeah. Uh, last, uh, the last you spoke about uh, the fortifying mm -hmm. with some specific nutrients. Yeah. So a mother is asking if mm. we want to, if she wants to fortify complementary food at yeah. home, yeah. Uh, like a baby cereal, yeah. or let's say with impoto poto, how will she go about it? So, for example, like a baby cereal, okay. or or like impoto poto. Okay. Let, let, let me talk about impoto poto first. Mm -hmm. Remember last time we mentioned some food sources of. And these nutrients okay. and we said that for example the iron you get it from meat yeah. uh, fish or chicken mm -hmm. or any uh, animal uh, source okay. and if it's the uh, zinc you also get it from animal um, sources okay. if it's the um, um, uh, vitamin a you get it from oil palm oil mm -hmm. or any um, colored fruits or vegetables mm -hmm. and so when you are preparing your food like a potato bottle or any other local dish yeah. you make sure that these things are part of the food and naturally you'd have added them to it okay. however if you are preparing a, a, baby, a, a baby cereal like this okay. like what we normally would call winning mix or tom brown in the house yeah, on the market on the market yeah. um normally you will have to add a cereal sure. um, or, or yeah so cereals like millets like okay. maize like rice, mm -hmm. which are mainly carbohydrate sources, okay. and then you also add um, a legume, mm -hmm. soya bean um, um, or normal beans, which are the legume. Now, these legumes contain certain essential amino acids. Mm -hmm. They come with some amount of fat. Some even mm -hmm. add granules uh, for the fat. Uh, some amount of fat. They come with um, certain amount of um, micronutrients, like the iron we are talking about. Yeah. Certain vitamins and minerals okay. as well. Especially vitamin A. Especially vitamin A. Mm -hmm. Some B vitamins as well. Okay. So they add on or add bring this on board. So when you enrich uh, and to enrich the okay. food, and that is a way of you having fortified it without necessarily having to go through the processing that is done um, at the factory level okay. yeah so these are ways to make sure that your blenderized feeds uh -huh. are fortified or the foods that you prepare at home uh, contain these nutrients okay. without much hazard yeah
Thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, thank you for teaching our mothers how to prepare a complimentary feed at home. Mm. And also, when you look at the consistency, mm. as our pediatrician mm. um, explained, we should go for more something thicker, like a paste form. Mm. You see that it's very difficult to pour. Mm. But when you go for something like that, this is not the ideal way to prepare a complimentary feed. Uh, thank you very much for coming. And you don't have to go through the hassle of buying any cereal to prepare a complimentary feed for your babies. Just contact Joao Foods at 020-6582-052 and it will be delivered at your own convenience. And also, if you're looking for the finest restaurants around in Accra, you can come to Breakfast to Breakfast located at Usu and you can also call them at 020-8800-008. If you've enjoyed the show and you'd like to be part of the show, kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel at Diet TV and hit on the notification bell so that you can receive notification anytime we release a new episode and if you have any question or topic you'd like us to discuss on the show kindly follow us at die tv on all social media platforms see you